basically on wednesday uh, on the 9th of november you know we all uh, woke up to the news um of the results of the election of the 45th president of the united states of america and, and uh, the republican nominee um j donald trump he won the elections and uh, so likewise as uh, as there has been a president uh, from the very beginning um his holiness the dalai lama in his personal capacity um has offered uh, congratulatory messages uh, to the white to, to, to donald trump and likewise on behalf of the central tibetan administration sikyong dorlosa senge sent a congratulatory message and uh, we also saw the speaker of the tibetan parliament in exile sent a congratulatory message and what we could see is the key of the message is how us is a great nation and how uh we as tibetans or the exiled tibetan establishment is grateful to the us uh, for what it has done for the tibet cause you know we share friendly ties uh, uh with with the us in the pre 1959 independent tibet era and uh likewise uh, there's there's been a lot of uh uh camaraderie between the US government and 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 Tibetans especially with his holiness you know a lot of the great leaders of the US share personal friendship uh, with his holiness and so likewise uh, the messages are asking the president elect um, to up keep the values that this great country or this great democracy uh the most successful democracy in the world uh values and cherishes